they don't know what to do about Israel and Palestine. They're just like trapped. They're trapped in the middle. Did oh you see um, in Philly where the uh, gay pride parade ran into the free Palestine parade? They oh, wouldn't let them pass? Yeah. Like, no, we're, our thing's more important. Right. Than you guys can each other. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Crazy. It's just the woke eating woke. It's yep. the left eating the left. Yep. But that's what they've always done. They eat themselves. By the way, the right does it too. The right does it too. They do it all. They do it all the time. It's a human characteristic that we can't really just say one side does because yeah. it's not true. The gay parade and the Palestine parade meeting up in the middle is like the time Kid Rock shot a bunch of Bud Light. <laughs> <laughs> No, because nothing's gonna die. No, <laughs> no, no business is gonna get crushed by it. <laughs> it's like no, you guys don't want to. You guys don't want to fight each other. Look at this. Look at the fucking. Look at the free Palestine. The gay pride is a standoff. It's a fucking flat out standoff. Hit jobs versus blow jobs no. over here. <laughs> <laughs> No pride in genocide. So they're stopping the pride parade. No, you can't have your parade. Our parade's more important. I love the masks. I just love them. Look oh, yeah. at all these people with masks on. Yeah. It is the liberals' MAGA hat. It is. Yeah. I've said it a million times, but that's what it is. It's a fucking MAGA hat. Oh, my goodness. These dorks. How many of them had fucking masks on, man? It's crazy. They don't even work. I mean, yeah. they work as well as that lady's visor that's turned backwards. Yeah. <laughs> And they definitely don't work against AIDS. So wearing one at a gay pride parade is completely pointless. <laughs> oh, imagine you think the mask, this is going to protect you. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they're wearing a mask outside. And meanwhile, they butt fuck strangers and glory holes and stuff. So it's like. I th honestly think it's more of the free Palestine people that were wearing the masks. You think anybody's ever worn a mask at a glory hole? What's that? Because they don't want to be identified in photos. That's true, too, right? That's pretty much most of it. You think most of it? <clears throat> yeah, retaliation. Yeah. I don't think it should be legal to wear a mask in public. I agree with that. I just think it's too creepy. You could rob someone. Yeah. It's, I mean, in New York City, if someone had a mask on in the past, you'd be like really wary. Oh, my God, this guy's got a ski mask on. Fuck. Yeah. It was scary. It means they were going to rob you and you couldn't identify them. Right. Why I, are we allowing that? It doesn't work. Right. The date is in, kids. Doesn't work. It never made sense. Even in the early days of the pandemic, there was a famous doctor that went viral because he was doing vape hits and he would put a mask on and the vape smoke would blow straight through the mask. And he was explaining like this is these vapor particles are bigger than COVID particles. Yeah. Like it's going right through that mask. It's not stopping jack shit and you're going to get it. Right. You're going to get it. And. You know, they said, oh, the masks work at the margins. Like, if you fuck with the numbers, because here's the thing. How many people wear masks all the time are also, are also super fucking paranoid, right? So they're avoiding crowds. They're not going out. How many people who won't wear a mask are a little loose? Mm -hmm. They're just like, fuck it. If I get sick, I get sick. I already got COVID. Fuck it. Yep. You know, they just go out. So you can't. It's hard to know. When you have a large group of when something as weird as the pandemic happens, and even then they can't show. It's not like the, all the people with masks showed. Eighty percent of them didn't get COVID. Uh uh. No, fucking they all got COVID. Everybody yeah. got COVID. Yeah. And then there's this this thing where they want to say it protects you from hospitalization and death. No, that's not true either. Because I know a lot of people who are vaccinated who got COVID who got to the fucking hospital. Mm -hmm. And I know a couple that died. Yeah. How many people do you know that died from COVID? I confirmed actually don't know anybody, I don't think. I mean, it's kind of debatable. Like Jeff Scott, I mean, I don't know. No, Jeff Scott, he died alone. Like in his, I don't think he had COVID. I mean, yeah, exactly. I know some people that died during that period, but really nobody. Jeff Scott was HIV positive too. Yeah, for a long time. I wonder if maybe he couldn't get his meds. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, because that was an issue during the pandemic as well. That's when we, f we realized that China makes all our medicine. Like what? <laughs> China makes a lot of things, yeah. man. It's yeah. crazy how much we rely on them for manufacturing stuff yep crazy yeah they're trying to mitigate some of that now samsung is actually putting in um a chip factory in austin huh yeah should be interesting yeah
we got to do something. We got to get businesses back over here and stuff. Yeah, we, well, we definitely shouldn't rely on a, a foreign country that we're, is not our ally for our fucking medicine. Like, Jesus. Right. That's so kooky. That is such a kooky thought. <laughs> it's, we live in the craziest times. It's so weird, man. Ooh.